Hey, good evening guys, it's uh, Daniel Oakley here, um, Pure Oakley 01. This is a very quick video, um, I've had quite a few messages of people um, asking about certain teas and what I have at the moment and how my um, my Nandu Chromatis is. So this is going to be a very, very quick uh, update video, um, I suppose like a May update video. But there will be another one of these coming next week, so uh, please check back um, for that video. So uh, yeah, this isn't going to be any feeding. This is just going to be a quick look at some of the teas that I'm that I've got downstairs at the moment, and obviously I've got a few in my bedroom. Um, so yeah, um, start this off with um, Tetra. Okay, so this is my um, my smallest Lassiodora Power High Banner. Um, the Brazilian salmon pink bird eater, which is about three inches, three and a half inches. I don't know if you can see where she is. Yeah, see, she's uh, got a pouch. She's due to molt, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bother her too much. I'll leave her alone. Um, in here, um, this is my Acanthoscuria genicolata, the um, giant whitening. It's in there somewhere. I hope. Um, I don't know where it is, I can't see it, so I'm going to trust this in there, it's hiding or molting or something. Uh, here is my Brachypalma Auratum, um, as you can see just there, it's got the uh, the flame, uh, flame knee, I believe it is, or flame, yeah, flame knee. This is probably two and a half, maybe three inch, uh, hopefully a female. I hope oh, I don't like getting my hopes up. In here, this is my um, my C. Marshalli, the um, great horn, straight horn baboon. Um, it's actually just there. If you, you probably can't see it. Yeah, it's probably about an inch, inch and a half. I never see that that tea. Next up is one of my favourites, um, and everyone's favourites. It's the Pocolotheria metallica, the Guti Sapphire ornamental. Um, I believe it's a female, um, recently molted, and I'll be getting another two of these um, next week. So I have three P Metallica, which is good because they're like um, you know one of the most uh, expensive and sought after tarantulas, and I'm a little bit greedy with them. So hopefully get some breeding going with them. Okay then, next up, yeah, hell no. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, next up is my P. Iramina, the Venezuelan sun tiger. I don't know if you can see her in there. You see the orange on her back. She's in a pre molt, so I'm not going to bother her. Okay, then my slings, um, just there, actually, you can see her, is my Grammar Stirler Pull Stripes, the um, Chaco Golden Knee. Don't bother that one because it's very small and I don't want to really stress it out or anything. Next up is my Brachypalma albiceps, who is just down there somewhere, I don't know if you can see it with a light. Yeah, once again, probably about an inch, quite small. That was uh, a gift from Alan or Ahikin. Next up is my uh, Brachypalma Amelia, who is just there, you can see her. Um, this is the Mexican red leg. Um, so yeah, these things are doing well. Uh, next up is my Brachia Palma Classy, uh, which is the Mexican pink. Who is in there somewhere? Actually, I think she's burrowed. Yeah, so I can't see her. She's just starting to get the um, the like uh, the leg warmers, as people refer to them as. So yeah, she's a um, pretty gorgeous girl. Not as gorgeous as uh, Zelda, of course, but, you know, no competition. <laughs> Next up is my Brachypalma Bohemi, as you can see just there. This is the um, Mexican fire leg. In fact, this one's quite big, so I'm going to take the lid off and uh, hopefully you won't run away and hide. I really can't see it, but oh, you can see it now. So you can see all the colours are coming through on him, or her, hopefully. 
I hope they, all of my teas are female, but uh, whether I'm lucky or not, I don't know. Next up is uh, Eva, my OBT. Um, she's a bitch. It's uh, plain and simple. I'm going to carefully drag her over here, and I will show you why she is a bitch. Okay. Um, this is the same OBT that I handled not too long ago. Um, this is the P. Marinus. And if you watch, you will probably see why she's a cow. Hopefully. Oh god, stop rubbing up. There she is. Okay, she's actually not. Okay. There you go. <laughs> this spider will attack me. <laughs> she's, um. <sighs> Better move out of the way so she doesn't jump. Yeah. So this is the P. Marinus, the OBT. She is fucking horrible. This is actually my least favourite tarantula that I own, uh, more so than any of my Pocletharia, which are a lot more venomous. So hopefully, I can just get this on, I'm going to see you in there. She's, um, it's quite unusual, because normally she rears up and tries to bite me. So hopefully she's going to do it. Actually, no, I better not stress her out. Yeah, but she does jump at me and um, goes into threat posture and tries to bite me quite happily. <laughs> Okay, so this next one is my largest Brachiopalma. Uh, this is my Smithy, um, the Mexican Redney, who has just gone into hiding because he's a bit of a pussy. Um, oh, I'll have a quick in there. See, he, sh he should be molting soon. Hopefully. Get a quick look at him. No light. You can see he's beautiful. Jet black, due to molt. Kicking hairs, so I'm not going to. Don't bother him, because uh, hopefully he'll mature, and then I'll either get a female for breeding, or I'll send him off a 50-50, or... Yeah, I'll sort something else, <laughs> something out. Rather, oops, sorry. Okay, so next up is my uh, Eupalestris Campostratus, the um, pink zebra beauty. So, um, yeah. Uh, this is Zoe. She's um, she's actually a really fantastic tarantula. Um, very very docile. So I can just be careful of you. So yeah, I mean, this is how to um, pin a grip a tarantula. She's so docile. She you can rub her fangs and everything, and uh, got fat shoes. You can see she's just fantastic. Oops. Look at that. <laughs> so docile. She um she's a faster, she doesn't really eat very often. Which kind of sucks. But uh no she's uh she's a lovely tea. I don't know whether to get rid of her or to keep her. Ah finally the uh the queen of my collection, the diamond. Um my absolute favourite, probably even more so than my, any of my uh, gooties. Um, don't be skittish. Um, come here, come on, you, come on. There she is. Here she is. This is Zelda, my Lassiodora Power High Banner. Um, the Brazilian. Salmon pink bird eater. She's uh sorry I've just got back from work, so that's why I'm a bit but yeah. This is my favourite tea. Um you can definitely female. Come on. Honestly, you couldn't get a better tea than this. She is my favourite. How big she is. She's um, what is she? Uh, for, she's about forty months old. So yeah, I love her. She's fantastic. <laughs> okay then, and finally, um, in fact, I'm gonna do the next one in a separate video. So I'll um, pause it for a second.